you are the assistant professor and site director of the hybrid master's program in professional behavior analysis at Florida Institute of Technology, otherwise known as FIT. Now that's a mouthful. I had to write it down so that I could spit all of that out. What does it mean? You did much better than I could ever do. Uh, <laughs> I don't think so. And we also sometimes call it Florida Tech. So okay. some people call it Florida Tech, some people call it Florida Institute of Technology. Good to know. So here's the deal. This is a master's program in professional behavior analysis. In other words, we'll give some emphasis to conceptual issues. We'll give some info emphasis on experimental analysis of human behavior, but largely only in the context of what you do when you're working with kids and when you're working with families and when you're working within the context that you work in as a professional behavior analyst. Okay, so is it geared specifically toward autism or towards behavior? That's a great question. It actually is geared to the needs of the company that we contract with. Okay. So this is a program, it's called a hybrid master's program. The first portion of the classes that a student takes are taken online. The second portion of the classes, and this is where I come in because I teach the second portion, the second portion of the classes are taught in person by a board certified behavior analyst who's also a PhD and in the context of the work that you do. So FIT has a relationship with CARD. Okay. We teach card professionals who are en route to becoming board certified behavior analysts. Uh -huh. And we teach them through my presence within the company. I immerse myself within the culture of the company. I know exactly what every single person who works at card knows, doesn't know, would like to know, really doesn't want to know. All of that stuff I build in to the courses and the practicum assignments that I do. So there's two parts. There's coursework and there's intensive practicum. Okay. And so I imagine there are other organizations besides CARD that you work with as well. We're starting to. Okay. Ours, my, uh, the one, the arrangement that we have with CARD is the very first of the hybrid master's programs in professional behavior analysis. Uh, so we are, we're creating this model from a blank stone and chiseling away as we go. I really love this because I, we have, uh, when my son was going through therapy, we had a vast array of therapists who would come in that were different places in their education. And, uh, you know, some of them were getting their master's degree, some were getting PhDs, and they were talking about the frustration of being at CARD and, and having access to top level experts and hearing all these amazing things about autism and what could be accomplished, but they were going to universities and going into coursework where they knew more than their teachers. <laughs> right? And it was an exercise in frustration for them. And they were hearing some pretty old and antiquated uh, things and, and some places where they were saying, well, you just can't do this with a child. And they knew they had been in somebody's home earlier that day and seen that, that you could do that with a child and get to that progress. So I love the idea that people who are working at that level can come to your program and get more education. Yeah, that's cool. You know, I, I'm, I'm kind of unique in that I've, I've kind of split my career between mm -hmm. actually doing applied work as a clinician mm -hmm. and also being a researcher. So I'm interested in, in both aspects of yeah. it. And I, I, I love I love rolling up my sleeves, getting my hands dirty, wearing a t-shirt and doing what I have to do, <laughs> you know, and then having a spare set of clothing in my car so that I can come into the boardroom and make a presentation and... Very cool. But in the other place, you can be rolling on the floor with the kids uh, getting something accomplished. That's what the t-shirt in my car is for. <laughs> <laughs> Love it. So if somebody's interested, and we were talking a little bit before the break um, about the fact that more and more parents are saying, hey, if I need to learn this and I really need to immerse myself in this world of ABA and really understand it, I, I want to get a degree in it. I want to be able to understand it. I want to be able to work in this field. I want to take what I've done with my child. I want to be the best I can be with my child. And then I want to take what I've learned and be able to help other kids, I would think this would be a great program for them. So how would they find out more information? Uh, easy enough to contact me. Uh, I'm here at CARD. I'm here in Southern California. So 
I'm one person that you can contact. And uh, I should I just say what my contact information you is? You absolutely can. Uh, easiest way to contact me is by email, tszabo at fit.edu. Okay. And uh, I think, Shannon, I'll just leave you with contact information okay, for great. me. And Jose Martinez Diaz is uh, our uh, associate dean and a director of the program in Florida Tech. Okay. And uh, I assume they also, have a website. Yeah, you can also go online to the FIT website. Okay. And look for the hybrid master's program in professional behavior analysis.